Opulence by Charles Hoy Fort, Part 1, Chapter 3J. Among our later emotions will be indignation against all astronomers who say that they know whether stars are approaching or receding. When we arrive at that subject it will be the preciseness of the astronomers that will perhaps inflame us beyond endurance. We note here the far smaller difficulty of determining whether relatively nearby comet is coming or going. Upon November 6, 1892, Edwin Holmes discovered a comet. In the Journal of the British Astronomical Association, Volume 3, page 182, Holmes writes that different astronomers had calculated its distance from 20 million miles to 200 million miles and had determined its diameter to be all the way from 27,000 miles to 300,000 miles. Professor Young said that the comet was approaching. Professor Parkhurst wrote merely that the impression was that the comet was approaching the Earth. But Professor Berberick, English mechanic, volume 56, page 316, announced that, upon November 6, Holmes, comet had been 36 million miles from this Earth, and 6 million miles away upon the 16th, and that the approach was so rapid that, upon the 21st, the comet would touch this Earth. The comet, which had been receding, kept on receding, 